Project 1B, how to use a safety needle device. It is all about your patients and your safety. Warning, you will work with sharp items in this project. Take great care to avoid injury to yourself and to others. Safety features of the AutoSafe Reflex needle make needle injury less likely, but there is no substitute for being careful. The Needle Stick Safety and Prevention Act of 2000 makes engineered sharps in injury protection mandatory in USA workplaces. In practice, it means that safety needles and safety devices are compulsory in the USA and in a number of other countries. The Apprentice Dr. Venipuncture Kit contains autosafe reflex safety needles based on a comparative study of five types of safety needles. The Healthcare Product Evaluation Center conducted the research at the University of Virginia. Autosafe reflex safety needles are very effective and easy to use. However, one has to use them correctly. Follow these instructions exactly. Look at the diagram of the needle with its various parts. Open a clean work surface cover. On it, place the unassembled venipuncture trainer, an open 5 milliliter syringe, and an unopened safety needle. Wash your hands. Start now to develop this simple but effective habit. Orientation is important when opening the AutoSafe Reflex Safety Needle. Hold the needle with a paper cover facing up. The needle is packed with its bevel facing up towards the paper cover. Kept in this orientation, the needle will be positioned correctly for performing clinical procedures like venipuncture. Lift the edge of the paper cover and peel it backwards. Pinch base of the package at the fold and fold it downward. Fit the needle to the syringe and withdraw the safety needle from the package while maintaining the needle's orientation. Withdraw the syringe plunger to fill the syringe with 3 to 5 milliliters of air. Pull the safety mechanism back and hold gently in the activated position with your middle or index finger just on the one side. Remove the needle's protective straw-like sleeve. Perform a simulation intramuscular injection by injecting the venipuncture trainer. Penetrate the skin at 90 degrees and insert the needle up to the level of the safety device. Inject the 3 to 5 milliliter air into the venipuncture trainer. Never inject air into a real patient, neither subcutaneously, nor intramuscularly, nor intravenously. Remove your index finger from the safety mechanism. Withdraw the needle. You will notice the reflex mechanism activates spontaneously and passively. The sharp needle tip will be covered by the safety cap in a somewhat off-center position. Discard the used needle in the sharps waste container. In a clinical setting, you will discard the complete unit, in other words, the assembled needle attached to the syringe. In rare instances, after activating the AutoSafe Reflex Needle Safety Device, you may need to expose the needle again. Follow these steps to safely expose the needle again. Hold the syringe and needle in one hand with the small opening in the protective cap pointing up. Hold the needle's protective sleeve between the thumb and index finger of the other hand. With a gentle twist of the wrist, redirect the needle to touch the upper inner surface of the protective cover. Hold it in this position and gently slide the protective cover open with the fingers of the other hand. Keep the needle activated by holding the device in the activated position with the middle or index finger.